perfect for hot days. Enjoy the tangy natural sweetness of this easy to make beverage. Follow along and refresh yourself with this delicious, delightful treat. To start off, let us first prepare our entire batch of passion fruits. Begin by selecting each passion fruit and cutting it in half. Once halved, use a spoon or any other culture to carefully scoop out the juicy pulp and seeds from each fruit, collecting them into a bowl. Repeat this process for every passion fruit until all of them have been thoroughly processed. This method ensures we have all the delicious tons inside of the passion fruit, which we can then use for our recipe or enjoy fresh by working methodically through each fruit we maximize our yield and ensure that none of the precious contents go to waste. With all passion fruit pulp into the bowl, add one half cup of sugar and a glass of water. Mix thoroughly, ensure that sugar dissolves completely. Once mixed, pour the contents into a blender for further processing. If you have not yet subscribed, I highly recommend that you do so. Make sure that you also hit the notification bell to stay updated with all of Almasi's latest videos. By subscribing, you will never, and I mean never, miss out on any new content, exciting recipes, or helpful tips. The support means a lot to us and helps us continue creating great videos for you to enjoy. Don't miss out. So, this is your time. Subscribe and turn on notifications. With that done, we can now transfer the fruit pulp into the blender to ensure that we capture any remaining pulp. We can rinse the bowl with another glass of water and pour this into the blender as well. Secure the blender lid as firmly as possible and then turn on the blender. Of course the blender will vibrate a bit but it's okay. Anyway, we can blend until the mixture is smooth and well combined. This step eventually ensures that all the passion fruit goodness is incorporated and ready for the next stage of our recipe. By thoroughly blending, we can achieve a consistent texture and flavor, making sure that nothing goes to waste and every bit of fruit is utilized.
Now that the blending is complete, we can now transfer the contents back into the bowl for the next step. Our goal here is to separate the juice from the pulp, allowing it to be as smooth and flavorful as possible. In order to do this, place a sieve of a jug to catch the juice. We can start by scooping small amounts of the blended mixture into a sieve using any utensil at your disposal. It can be a cup or a bowl. Using a spoon, we can gently stir and press the mixture against the sieve. This will eventually extract juice from the pulp. Also, it will help extract the juice while leaving the seeds behind. Continue the process as patient because this process is long and it requires patience. So, you add small amounts of the blended mixture into the sieve using of course the cup and start to release as much juice as possible. Be thorough then, ensuring that you extract as much amount of juice as possible. This method will ensure that our final juice is smooth and free from any seed or excess pulp. Once you have sieved all the blended mixture, you can discard the left over seeds and pulp or you can repeat the same process with just half a cup of water like I do. Then you'll be left with a jug of pure delicious passion fruit juice ready for the next stage of our recipe or to be enjoyed as it is. This careful sieving always guarantees a high quality juice capturing the full flavor and aroma of the passion fruit you are getting to your final product. And there you have it, pour your freshly extracted juice into a glass and enjoy the amazing taste of passion fruit juice. Release the fresh and vibrant flavor, a perfect treatment.